lightweight title fight between Bruce Lee and Michael the Menace Johnson. Hey guys, this is Mr. Jojo. Today I'll be showing you the lightweight championship between Bruce Lee and Michael Johnson. I hope you guys can like it. Alright, here he is, the number one lightweight contender making his way to the octagon and looking to leave as the new undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. He has bided his time, waiting for this title shot. He's got the winning streak. He has the quality of opposition. Now he's fighting the number one guy in the world. He believes he's the best. Now his opportunity to prove it just a few minutes away. All right, here he is, the reigning defending undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. Of course, the target is on his back. All eyes are on this man tonight as he tries to make good on yet another title defense. He has owned this division for some time. The question is, as the challenges get stiffer, can he remain the hunted? Several championship fights to his credit, a lot of 25-minute wars. As he gets older, the challenges get stiffer. We'll see how he handles this one tonight. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Johnson is three years his senior. He is three inches taller. He will have a one-inch reach advantage. We send it inside the octagon. We find Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. Now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds for the UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 20 wins, 16 losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Boca Raton, Florida, presenting the challenger, Michael the Menace Johnson. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, so the fight is underway. We will see how it plays out. It's a pick and fight according to Las Vegas, and really hard to think of a weakness that we've seen on film from either guys in their UFC careers. Though. I feel like both of these guys are the top of the food chain. They're the best of the best that we can put inside the octagon. They are so well-rounded. They have every skill, and that is going to be on display tonight in this key matchup. Misses with the left hook. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. The slip, and then the counter by Johnson. Just out of range with that left hook. Able to check that kick as well. Circling towards the left now. 
Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Timing his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very accurate. Once again, looking for that highlight reel KO with that front kick. Lee's head kick is blocked. No damage there. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Left hand punches the clinch. Oh, disguise that. Nice trip to get the takedown from the clinch. So there, I mean, I know you can get out of some bad spots, but not with that type of speed. You cannot allow him to get leverage on the bottom. What a sweep. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, here's the head kick. It's blocked. Big punch land. Throwing with authority. Johnson gets hit with that hook shot there. He's got to be careful to not allow the offense to follow up here. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Nice straight punch. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. He's able to slip the left. There's the kick. It's blocked. Quick entry to get Man, it on a that single. that was a great single. Oh. He flips him over the top. What a huge takedown. I mean, do I survive that, or have no, I read John, my last round? Absolutely not. You don't survive that. It's over. It's over, John. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Nice kick with the right hand. Going orthodox now. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, huge leg kick. That's going to leave a mark. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, he switches his stance again. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very, very well. That's the biggest shot in the fight thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Oh! Wild attempt with the right hand there. Another shot lands upstairs. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Oh, oh big time. knee. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh. Final seconds of round one. Round two winding down. All right, so a big knockdown for him, courtesy of that punch in that round. DC, here's a replay. Big moment in the previous round. They were both fighting very well, but when he landed this punch right here that sits his opponent down, it showed that the power is not equal, and if he can land, he does have the ability to damage him. connect on a lot of shots to the midsection and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. 
good punch. Beautiful right hook counter. Telegraph that spinning back fist. Bleeding from his cheek now. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, just misses. Time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, nice combination of kicks once again. Oh, beautiful level change. Back to the feet now. Trying to go to the body here. Unable to find the target. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Overhand attempt now, it's blocked by Johnson. Came of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. I mean, the hand speed, just absurd. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. So thank you so much guys for watching this video. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. So this is the lightweight championship between Bruce Lee and Michael Johnson. Thank you guys for watching. Great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right until eventually he found the shot that ended the fight. We send it inside the Ladies octagon. Bruce Buffer has the, the, the official decision. Contest at two minutes, 14 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by...